Hello and welcome to the first of this year's All-Ireland Football Semi-Finals. It's been a, a, a brilliant experience for me for the last, whatever it is now, 30 years. Um, it's very challenging, but uh, obviously to be involved in something that is so popular uh, with people. Uh, year in, year out, people say to me, kind of, you know, do you ever get fed up doing it? And of course, you never ever do because there's always something new every year, kind of, you know, and it's, it's a new challenge. It's a new challenge for all the counties every year, and therefore it's a new challenge for us in actually presenting that uh, to the public. So, no, it's, it's, been, it's been great fun. Mayo should have been All Ireland champions last year. They threw it away with two ridiculous goals. When the light goes on and the debate starts up, do you know what's going to happen at that point? No, and especially if Joe Brawley is around, I certainly don't. Um, no, I mean, we do up to a point. You know, we, we structure the thing up to a, a, a certain degree, so you have a broad idea where the programme is going. You have to have that, up, otherwise it'll be chaos. But, but then you kind of play it by ear, depending on what crops up, depending on what's happening in the match and so on. You know, you have to sort of go with the flow of it, kind of, and, and, and go with the kind of the trend of the conversation as well and see where that might take you. Well, joining me here in the studio this afternoon, Colin Moore, Joe Brawley, and the now former Galway football manage, manager, Alan Mulholland. Alan, you're very welcome indeed to the programme. You know, I mean, our analysts, and we've said this before, uh, we're, we're blessed across the board, whether it's Gaelic games, rugby, soccer, mm -hmm. to have the kind of analysts that we do. Mm -hmm. They're very opinionated, very articulate. Uh, most of them have been there. They have the medals, you know, the, they have the certificates and all that sort of thing. Okay. You've a lifetime of involvement as a player and as a coach with Galway football. Big decision, obviously, to step down. We all know they're out there trying to do their best, you know, but they have taken this responsibility upon themselves. So therefore, they know that they're open to criticism if they have a bad day, if things are not going well, if the tactics are not right, if the performance is less than what it should have been. You know, that's, that's fair game. This is a very expensive venue to run. Somebody has to pay these well, people. Well, you know, so, listen, you know, this, 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 it is, this place, look, was, it is what this it place is. was paid so, off over 10 years ago. Yeah, I mean, we've I, always I, been able to run I, our I affairs. Think not, the, the, I find it a, a very lively experience. Great, great to work with these people. Even though it can be challenging, at times it can be a big challenge if they sort of get stuck into each other and you're trying to adjudicate the thing, you know, but that's, that's part of the, the show.